Good morning to you beautiful people out there in the world. How are you? It's actually afternoon, actually. It's actually one in the afternoon, so good afternoon, I guess. Um, but who's counting? Anyway, I have a package that came in today, you guys, and I'm so very excited about it. And I also need to run to the grocery store because I want some chicken. I feel like I talk about chicken every vlog, but I just have a, a taste for some. So I'm about to go pick that up from the grocery store. Y'all trying to come with me? Y'all, I hate going in the grocery store, like, for real. I got my package. I got my cheese. Don't y'all just love cheese? I'm really excited about this package because I'm on a couple of different journeys. So, as you guys know, I'm on a weight loss journey. I'm trying to lose some weight, shed some pounds. So, if you guys haven't checked out any of my weight loss journey videos or vlogs, I'll leave a link, a card above. But, um... I'm also on a journey to, of like self-discovery, self-worth, self-love, and all that. And I feel like in the pursuit of all that, like it's so important to have like some quality time with yourself. Like I feel like we always want to like spend quality time with other people. And while that's so very important, I think a lot of times we don't spend enough time with ourselves. And I'm a big, huge like advocator of quality time with yourself and spending time alone in the process i've run out of ideas of like activities to do like of course i can go get a pedicure of course i can go for a walk but like i want to like make memories with myself as well as like with the people i love and so when i discovered this book which is i guess i can unbox it now so i caught the adventure challenge solo book and I'm really excited about this. I was actually introduced to um, the, the book series by a friend some months ago. And we were talking about the couples edition of the book. The book has like tons of activities that you could do. Um, it, tell, it outlines how much time it'll take, what you'll need to do it. And then like each activity is a surprise because it's covered by a like scratch off situation. So you really don't know what you're going to be doing until you actually scratch it off. But I only thought that the book was for couples. Like I didn't know that they had books for like like activities to do with your friends and even activities to do by yourself or solo so when i saw that they had this book i was like i definitely i'm definitely gonna copy it functions as like an activity book and then also like a photo album sell these books in a set it can come with a polaroid camera um but i already have one i actually have the instax mini 40. it has the rules outlined in here basically and it also has a legend and basically it just gives you clues about the activity they allow you to be able to attach a photo so you would attach a polaroid picture here and it allows you a space to write down any notes or memories about the specific um activity i'm about to do one of the activities now don't know if i i really want to go out or be active like that right now <laughs> the activity i'm going to try out today is called party trick-or-treat so basically it says it's free um it could be done anytime it's going to take about an hour um it's a chill activity um but it's at home so i don't have to leave the house today 10 years later Bro, I think that was the biggest scratch off I've ever done in my life. <laughs> like, it took me forever to scratch it off. But so it says go online and research the top 10 party tricks. Find the one that speaks to you the most and learn it. It could be a card trick, opening a bottle, a unique way, or even bending spoons. FaceTime a friend and show them. I'm reading from this article that says random party tricks to do it while you're stuck at home. Light a matching style. Flip an egg in a shot glass. Turn water into to whiskey with this simple trick. Oh, I kind of want to do this. Fill a shot glass with whiskey and a shot glass with water and then fill those both up to the brim. Place a playing card on top of the water glass. Using both hands carefully place water glass cap with the playing card on top of the um, full whiskey glass move your hands away carefully and watch as the whiskey transfers magically to the top glass wait a few moments for the transfer to complete do I have clear shot glasses I have those ones Keisha gave me I want to try those I don't have any playing cards but what I do have card stock so I feel like that's the same thing right 
Let's let's try this. All right, so I'm sitting here. I got everything I need. I got this giant bottle of Fireball. As you can see, that is whiskey. I have some water. I have two shot glasses. And I have some cardstock that I can cut up into a couple of different pieces. removed the card and it still is not transferring i'm a little annoyed because that didn't work but what i think is the reason i think the reason is because fireball have, has all that extra syrup in there which makes it heavier than the water so maybe if i use just straight whiskey i'm gonna try to use jim bean this time try this again if not i give up See if all of it goes. You think all of it go, or is it all just gonna mix and just be one even colored situation? You think? <laughs> this is so fun. This is gonna be a nice little book to look back over. Whistle. Whistle. Oh, Kia answer. I finally got the. It actually sent me a notification. Oh, really? I gotta show y'all my magic trick. <laughs> Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you was too high, too. Hey, you gotta do what? I gotta show y'all my magic trick. Oh, what's good? So I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna turn whiskey, right? Mm -hmm. Into water, or water into whiskey. Hey, girl, what? Okay, I got, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm vlogging it, too, so say hey to the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Can y'all see the, the shot glasses? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what you doing first, turning it to water? What? Basically transferring it from one shot glass uh -huh. to the other. Bro, what kind of paper is that? It's car stock. <laughs> okay, it's car stock, okay. I was oh. supposed to use a playing card, which would have been easier to move out, but I don't, yeah, I don't have any playing like it's... And then the water is going to the bottom and then the whiskey is going to the top here. Yeah, I see it. Ooh. Wait, no, okay, so explain the science behind this. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. Well, <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> so, when you taste the whiskey again, is it going to taste like whiskey? Or okay, is it so gonna be diluted? I'm definitely, yeah, it's going to be diluted, but I'm definitely not. Science King? <laughs> you know, just a little, just a little experience. Oh, Magic King? Yes. Call me Houdini. Yeah. And I took my little Polaroid. <laughs> y'all that was actually really fun <laughs> like really fun i'm excited to do more of these activities and i'll probably vlog a lot of them and shout out to kia and lisa for sitting through my demonstration <laughs> i'm excited to do more of these activities or more of these challenges like that was so much fun. Um, I'm really ready to do something that requires me to actually get out and leave the house. This was a very simple first activity, but it's time to push the lim limits a little bit. And I'm excited to see what else this book has in store. And just even to be able to look back at some of this stuff like years from now and just remember the time. I think it'll be super dope. I'm, I'm really excited about it. And I'm so big, especially recently on like you know creating memories documenting everything but anyway i'm about to wrap this video up i just kind of wanted to come on and share that but anyway that was a fun way to start my week <laughs> it's super dope so dope and it's, there's gonna be pictures for everything when i'm done i've never actually like finished a journal so this will be really fun to actually finish <laughs>